So as you've built out the team at Capiche, and as you brought together this, this band of individuals who are clearly going to become like just, uh, just experts in the world of creating awesome voice of customer task force and voice of customer reporting groups, what were some of the tools that you and the, and the team had to think about or had to invest in early as you were growing Capiche to be able to manage this growth, to be able to continue to socialize what you guys were learning with your tool and how you could actually help some of these customers and these ICPs with your Capiche solution? I like to think about these things in a layered fashion. So, so let me start at the real bottom layer. We were fortunate enough that the age of the company, we, we grew up in an era where Slack was just emerging or had just emerged. We've been on Slack for a long time and, and we've got that layer of communication there. We're also very fortunate that we, we emerged around a time where, you know, technologies like segment.com um, were prevalent and available. So from the very first day of, of the product existing and being used by customers, we've had events being captured in the product, feeding into segment and feeding out into a data warehouse. And so we've had that data warehouse in place you know, and I'm not sure if this is common or not, but we've had this data warehouse in place since day dot. And it's really served us well in terms of being able to collect that data and interrogate that data and understand that data, at least from a quantitative side, um, around product engagement and product metrics and product usage. So we've built on top of that um, and we've, we've laid different BI solutions on top in order to, to really understand product usage and product engagement. Um, one of our CSMs devised a score called a high value product engagement score. And so what it does is it looks at our end users usage with the Capiche product and it scores it not just on, you know, how much time are they spending on the platform, but how many clicks are they, are they making? We tie the scoring to our expected um, product journey or customer journey inside the product. So when they do certain different actions within the product, they get scored different amounts of points. Okay. And those and those points get totaled up each week to give a score out of 100 on a per user basis on how highly engaged or how much of these high value product engagement activities are they doing on a weekly basis. So every single user in Capiche, they are unbeknownst to them generating a score of zero to 100 based on their weekly usage. And CSMs are prioritizing their outreach to accounts or their, their education activities based on that score. So that's kind of the quantitative side. And then we've got a whole bunch of stuff, you know, we, we really focus on weekly active users. That's our, that's our North Star metric for our product team. So we focus on that a lot. And there's a whole bunch of downstream stuff on top of that. 